Hey, Treasure Valley Dave here. And uh, today we have a series of open houses um, in this Hubble community, Hubble Homes. And let's take a quick tour of this one. This one's got five, potentially six bedrooms, four bathrooms. Did I count that right? That's incredible. But uh, also they're giving away free tacos. So I'm kind of interested in checking that out as well. So uh, let's take a quick look and then get down to business. What a great house. It's got plenty of space for all sorts of living here. Five bedrooms, potentially six bedrooms. Huge backyard. And no rear neighbors. It backs up to a huge green area. What you do is Go past the uh, neighbor's house here. What if you needed a reason to get out? Get yourself a little puppy, come out for walkies, grab the football, come out and play with the kids. For you daring type, maybe you'll get the skateboard out. This you will not find in every subdivision, but you've got it right here. Oh, there's that taco truck. We'll go check that out too. My goodness, look at this. No rear neighbors, plenty of space, tons of fun. Yeah, I'm liking this. Well, here we are at the open house on the south part of Nampa. It's a Hubble open house. And uh, we're gonna take a quick look around to see what a brand new Hubble home looks like. Let's take a look. So we just walked in the front door and then right off to the left. It's a nice little bedroom. Certainly seems big enough. And the living area. I suspect this is probably the formal dining area. Certainly big and airy. That opens up here into the living area. And then the nice big kitchen with a eating area over here. Let's take a closer look in the kitchen here. It's got that nice subway tile. Nice big uh, island here. It's a nice big pantry storage area. Back in the kitchen, okay. another <laughs> space for the uh, refrigerator. But then a nice, another counter here. What's cool about this is look how wide all this space is in here. I mean, everybody could be in here messing around in the kitchen and they're not gonna be running into each other. One place we haven't been yet is upstairs. Oh, wow. Family area, kids play area. Is it okay to have the man cave upstairs? And what we've been waiting for, the master. I don't know if the camera quite captures it, but this, no, we're not using one of them fisheye lenses like, you know, everybody else does. This is just a really big room. No rear neighbors here. Alrighty, and an important place would be the master bath. Dual vanity, very nice. And those nice big soaker tubs. And here's one of two walk-in closets. Again, this is a really big area. It's not just a camera lens because we don't have none of that fancy stuff. And on the other side is another ample closet so that's two linen closets if you will and we saw one walk-in closet and here is the other walk-in closet two walk-in closets hers and hers two linen closets tons of space 
nice and bright. I don't know, looks like a winner to me, huh? Yeah, yeah. I am Jenny Blake with Epic Realty and I am helping Hubble Homes with their open houses today. This particular floor plan is the Yosemite at $359.90. I did work in the contracts department for two years for Hubble Homes became an outside sales rep and I still believe in their product and they are kind enough to let me host open houses. I've watched, I've done two build jobs with them now. Um, it is a great product. Product. My husband has been in construction in the Valley for 35 years, floor covering. So watching that build and seeing what they do is phenomenal. They have um, a fully conditioned crawl space like I was telling you about, yeah. um, that it has a fan that goes 20, 24 seven, um, keeping the, the temperature at a steady, okay. steady thing. They are Energy Star qualified now. They are also HERS rated. Um, so a lot what of, does that mean? So it just saves on your overall um, expenses mm -hmm. for your utilities. So and a lot of um, builders don't get that certification. Some do the HERS rating, your windows and stuff, low E windows, just help save money in the long run gotcha. with everything. They do have a wonderful warranty that you've got that in the package. They have one, five, and 10 year. Sorry, I'm a little gray on the details, but um, again, there's many communities out there. It's, it's a great process to go through. They have their in-house warranty department. So if you're having any problems or questions, they are local. Here as well, you just have a home's warranty and you shoot them an email and they come out and take a look and help you out and get that product done for you. And then, so Hubble has communities throughout the valley, so if I like a particular floor plan, the chances are I might be able to have it put in the community that I want? Correct. There are hit and miss some, um, in, in Boise it's a little tighter, the lots are a little smaller, so there's some that you won't necessarily be able to get a three car garage in. Okay. Um, CUNA has larger lots that are available, they're taking lot reservations right now. Um, so it's a good good time if you're building, get into contract now because the price point, six, eight, 12 months, and each subdivision the build time is different because the cities take a little bit longer um, getting their permits. So that can delay your process there. And then as soon as that's getting, but they send, throughout the process, they regularly keep the agent, the lender, the title company, and the buyer all in the loop. An email comes out and says, we're at this point, here's your estimated closing date. As they get closer and closer, they can dial in that closing date a little bit better. Okay, um, so if I'm still in California or you know, wherever, probably California, <laughs> um, I could come up here and go under contract and lock in today's price and mm -hmm. the bill will take, how long do you think it would take? It just depends on the subdivision. Okay. So um, the Hubble representatives will, per subdivision will be able to give you those time frames. Um, certain ones can be five and a half months, others are eight to 10 and a half months. Okay. Again, just depending on the city releasing the permits and um, how far along they are. Um, again, like Greyhawk is just doing lot reservations. They haven't released the lots yet to purchase. Mm -hmm. So as soon as the plant, the plat is recorded from the city, they're then released and then you go into the actual contract. Okay. And it'll set up, they give you a time frame. they get you under contract, basically doing your plan, the elevation, meaning do you want the front porch um, for the craftsman or a country elevation? and then you'll go to showroom and pick out all of your design colors and do the structural meaning uh, the fans if you want the extra lighting coming in all of that kind of stuff that's usually a week to two weeks out after going into contract depending on their backlog okay. and they have a beautiful showroom to go right and that's over meridian right yes that is right um off of basically the eagle road and the freeway gotcha okay so if i'm looking at I have a commitment that I can't move out for half a year retirement or whatever. Mm -hmm. I could come up here and lock in this lower price and still have a new home. But now do I have to come up with the 5% or 20% down to get the process started? It's a thousand dollar earnest money. Really? To lock it in. Mm -hmm. And then depending on your selections, they have, um, say you spend over a certain percentage, then you might need to bring in additional funds. Mm -hmm. Not very many people do go over those limits. 
but it would be say the the first limit is an extra fifteen hundred dollars just because if you're doing a bunch of stuff and you default right. on the contract they want to make sure that they can recoup those funds okay. so those funds are non-refundable they go into the house the earnest money if say you no longer are approved for the loan that is refundable the same way it, it is with the the standard process okay um what if i'm already retired and i have just caught up here and I need a nice place to live. Are there any hovels that I can move into right away? Yes, there are today, I believe in this subdivision, there are 12 available. We've got them all ready for the tour, but okay. each, um, uh, looking them up online, the new never occupied, those are move-in ready right now. So there's there's quite a few in most of the subdivisions that they have. Okay, and the house that we're looking at now, I count five bedrooms and Yes. I don't know how four, many bathrooms. <laughs> five bedrooms and four bathrooms. Wow. And then the little bonus area space. And this house, for a build, you can actually build up to six bedrooms. So the extra bonus room could be converted into an optional gotcha. fifth bedroom. Okay. So. Um, what if I didn't need this much space? Does Hubble have something smaller? They do. They have about, I want to say about 13 different plans. They have single stories. They have single story with bonus. Um, they have a multitude of two-level homes as well. Okay. Anywhere from three up to seven bedrooms, I think, that they can get. Wow, just about something for everybody. Correct, correct. And if you have a really tight budget, um, as far as the building and your flooring and the showroom in, in builder grade, you still have three options of, of cabinets. There's, I think, 15 or so different carpet choices and flooring. So even if you can't go to your granite, you're still building a really nice house mm -hmm. within that base cost. Okay. So there's there's plenty of options, like I said, light fixtures, countertops, your cabinets, um, the flooring, the wall texture, the paint colors. So it's it's, they're not a custom builder, they are a production builder, mm -hmm. so some choices it is what they have that's what they have available but that's why they can offer these prices that they can gotcha. but the quality of the work is no different than a custom builder's work and um i do have people that won't be able to move up here for a couple of years is it possible to buy one and then have renters in it for yes. a year or two yes it is okay that's great to know yeah. as well um, is there anything that I forgot to ask you that's great about Hubble Homes? I'm trying to think. It's just a, a he's a great builder. He's a, a great guy. I know the owner personally. Okay. Um, it's, they're a good team. And, and they've been around a while. Yes, yes. So he's um, founded in 1997, actually. Don Hubble is, mm -hmm. is the founder. And um, they just, the project managers are phenomenal that take care of your build and you see them out on site all the time and they are a great team to build your home and make sure that everything's being taken care of. Wow. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. Um, I'm sure we all appreciate knowing this stuff and having these options available up here in the beautiful Treasure Valley. Yes, it's a great place to be.